Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I have a tutorial for you guys. I wanted to show you guys how I do my eyebrows. I had a request to do that. Um, and I just want to throw in a disclaimer in there. This is the way that I do my eyebrows. It's probably not any different than any other YouTubers do their eyebrows, but because it was a request, I thought I would honor the request. So if you're interested in seeing that, go ahead and stay tuned. So first, what you guys want to do is make sure that you wash your face. Make sure your face is nice and clean. And then you put this from Avon. And for me, it works really, really well. I do have to put an extra, um, some extra around here on my corners because it gets quite dry. But that's besides the point. Make sure that you do that for your um and then after that sometimes i won't say all the time because then i would be lying i don't want to lie to y'all but i would put on a primer on my eyebrows just to keep the color and everything on my brows so i use the wet and wild primer it was pretty cheap probably three dollars at walmart i'm not sure but it was it was pretty cheap so i decided to buy that so the next product i would be using is my wet and wild pencil it's a brown pencil be sure that this is sharpened so that you know you get a crisp line um you will need or this is what i use the um nyx pencil i forgot what it's called anyway it's the nyx pencil it has the pencil portion on it and then on the other side it has the spoolie portion on it and you are going to need this so that's what I use and I actually really really love it then you're going to need your concealer I use the LA girl pro concealer still in beautiful bronze and then you're going to need an angled brush and I purchased this angle brush a couple years ago pardon me it's kind of dirty I got this angle brush from Ulta a while ago so those are all the things that I use I have plucked my eyebrows to make sure that they are clean to where I need them to be so yeah this tutorial is going to be a little bit different for me because I need my glasses but I'm gonna take them off so that I can get to what I need to get to so stay tuned we're about to get in so once you've put that on, you're going to go ahead and brush those brows out with your spoolie. So go ahead and take your spoolie and you're going to brush it up. The best that you can with what you got. pretty good for what I got right so go ahead and take your pencil that fits what you desire make sure it's a sharp pencil is what I have and we're gonna outline the brow light strokes you don't want anything too dark that just looks fake And if it's not perfect, it's okay because you're going to be using concealer to clean it up. Once I do that, I will take my NYX or NYX, whatever you call it, the pencil, and we're going to fill in the rest of the brow, all the areas that are sparse. I'm just going to fill it in, light strokes, that's what it looks like. This is kind of thick right now. 
so you have to get it. Once you get more practice, you know, you'll get it to where um, you need it to be. And so this part is a little bit too square for me. Okay, and then you're gonna take your concealer and then you're going to make sure you have enough product on it, which I do. You probably can't see that. And then you're gonna go underneath it and clean it up. And then what you're gonna do is take your spoolie. And you're gonna kind of blend out the color. Normally I do this step before I put the concealer on. You want the front kind of faded. You don't want that harsh line. Here you can see the difference. And, this one, this one. and to me it looks pretty natural. It's not like a dramatic, you know, line. And to um, rid yourself of this halo, when if you're putting on foundation, you can put it on this um, on the top portion of your brow so you don't have that halo I got eyebrows look. So Let's go ahead and work.
beast.